Ok, so welcome to this video. We're going to see how to use ChatGPT. That is a powerful tool that can help in education. Ok, the first thing is to know how to use ChatGPT in the right way by knowing that has limits. ChatGPT can be a fierce ally research assistance. It can be your best friend and companion in your journey to master science, arts and technology. Ok, but how can ChatGPT use it to learn? as a powerful tool to sharp your mind. We need to learn how to interact with the model to extract aligned pieces of knowledge. We must know that has some artificial intelligence alignment because data sets of GPT-3, the current version, are constrained to 2021 data and current status of the reinforcement learning from human feedback that has been uh, trained with. AI as a trend. AI is on the rise. Technology will consolidate in the next years and artificial intelligence will get better at faster rates. ChatGPT community and users, we are constantly pushing the limits. By creating content, we enhance and stress test to future versions of ChatGPT. So we as a community, we get to know where are the limits in specific fields and we can help future versions of AI and ChatGPT to thrive, to see what is the limits, what are the limits, uh, so we can have opportunity in those areas that are not fully fully automated and fully understood by artificial intelligence. ChatGPT can assist in education, but how? With content generation, tell me the most 10 important questions of algebra you can ask ChatGPT. Can be used to generate educational materials, quizzes, flashcards, and summaries of complex topics. ChatGPT as a tutor, this possibility, I love it a lot. ChatGPT can be a tutor, for example, your math tutor, your physics tutor, your biology tutor, your arts tutor that can follow up your research line and provide you with best insights with question and answers using the Socratic dialogue. So you can, you can ask a lot of questions of math and ask for definitions. It's amazing. It says improve. ChatGPT can help you grade your essay, suggest improvements, analyze and deconstruct. Language, learn, translate. ChatGPT can help you translate and it can be a strong alternative to Google Translate. Research Assistant, this is very similar to Tutor. Research Assistant, ChatGPT can help students by giving definitions, summaries, help with citations, brainstorming solutions and with some research methodology. ChatGPT is evolving. Humans can actually learn and improve encyclopedias, scientific articles, and machines can actually learn from the new data and from humans with reinforcement learning to get better over time. The future version of ChatGPT will be a more intelligent artificial intelligence trained with more data sets, with improved reinforcement learning and possible being a lot more accurate. Artificial intelligence and ChatGPT challenges the future of AI. We must build a strong community of testers and developers so next models become better at faster rates and all humanity benefits. Current responses can be incorrect, misinformed, biased, and even unpredictable. So we need to work as a whole, as a community, to push the limits together, understand the limitations, and improve future versions. We need to learn how to interact with ChatGPT to create a know-how to empower our education. So, so, what is the strategy? If you love artificial intelligence and ChatGPT, start using it to integrate your workflow. Publish articles and content to make public your useful insights, good practices, and educate yourself. Discover the limits of the tool for particular field, for example, for law, for engineering, for robotics, for math research, and publish your results. Finally, I'm creating a course on ChatGPT on Udemy, so please check the link in the description if you want to support me. I really appreciate that you've seen this video until here. And be, take care and subscribe and comment. Thank you.